Hi, Dr. Connor here. We're going to do some uh, frisbee tossing this morning at home using a paper plate. So here we have our paper plate. We're going to have our thumb on the top and we're going to have our fingers on the bottom. So what does that mean? The top of my frisbee is the underside of the plate, the plate part that would be sitting on the table. That's where my thumb goes. And my fingers that are on the bottom, that is the part of the plate that would actually be where you put the food. So we have our plate upside down, we have our um, thumb on the top, and we have our fingers on the bottom. And then the steps to throwing our frisbee, I'm gonna stand sideways to my target, point my frisbee, bring it across my body, take a step towards my target, and then extend my arm and flick the frisbee right out towards the camera. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, so I've got myself a laundry basket target here. Um, you can put, I've got it kind of closed just so that you can see it in the frame, but I'm gonna back away from my target. Again, you gotta make sure that you have a clear area, make sure that you have permission because frisbees have a habit of flying away and getting into things they're not supposed to. So again, I've got my thumb on the top, fingers on the bottom, pointing it at my target, crossing my body, step, and flick, and try to flick it into your target. It's a little bit close for me, so it's hard to release it. So that's how to throw our Frisbee. You could throw it with a partner, you could set your teddy bear out across the room and try to throw it into the lap of your teddy bear. Um, if you have an opportunity to take this outside, um, then you can obviously try to throw it a lot further. Um, be careful if you don't have a Frisbee. If you use something like a plastic plate, make sure that it's not too hard so that if you miss the catch, it um, doesn't hit you. Um, and also make sure that it's not a breakable kind of plastic because um, you don't want to spoil your plate. So, uh, catching the Frisbee. So, we, two ways we can catch our Frisbee. One way we can catch our Frisbee is crab claws. So, that means we're going to take our thumbs under our fingers and snap them like crab claws. So crab claws is one way that you can catch your frisbee and you just catch it between your fingers. And when you get really good at it and reach out, you'll be able to do crab claws also with one hand. So those are your crab claws. The second way is alligator jaws or an alligator snap. So you're gonna have your hands like this and you're gonna snap the frisbee in between. So that's another way to do it. So if this is my frisbee, I can do my alligator jaws or alligator snap. So crab claws, alligator snap, just to review again, thumb on the top, fingers on the bottom, point, cross, step, flip. Have fun.